he's a uh, graduate by at least of this area. And as I got to know him more, I found out some of his relatives that I had went to school with at Revised Lease. And, you know, one that's grew up with it. And you talk about, you know, these black people know about the underdog thing. That shit really bothered us, and I don't get to do it because we've been underdog. And these people were definitely underdogs. The ex mayor of the day, Broadway, just took these guys for granted. And they were just, just out there just doing it. And I guess he, you know, just said, well, uh, you know, that's the truth. You know, you're going to have to pay attention to everybody. All right. You can't just look at a certain because, you know, I look at the, uh, don't even bring this up, in Cook County uh, race. And he was saying, some people were saying, well, you know, Stroger probably get back in. And it's between Stroger and Dorothy Brown. And a certain guy told me, he said, well, pregnant, but she can just get it. It'll be one of three. And then uh, she won. So in this case, this guy was over there just putting out signs and hitting. And these young guys are just the energy that you've had, the energy. And they wanted it, they couldn't be stopped. And they did. And, you know, it goes to show you that you have to fail yourself. As Michael Jordan said, don't be afraid to fail. And we, we as black people should know that. Yes. And so we, we you know, he did it. You yeah. know, and as we look at Dr. King's thing, is uh, he say, Dr. King said one real eloquent and important and intelligent thing. Say, if you're running a race, and if you're behind in a race, you must run faster than the person in front of you or you'll forever be behind, right. right, Dan? You'll forever be behind. <laughs> and Brother Davis, from Congressman Davis, our congressman know about that. Then people told him what he couldn't do, but he's now the congressman. Right. And we'll hear from him later. But Brother Jones and his people that he had around him, Brother Sherman Jones, they did the so-called impossible. When the other guy tried to come make a comeback, it was too late. It's like getting, you know, uh, getting in the eighth inning and trying to make a comeback. That's, that's not always easy to do. So he proved that it's not over until it's over. And he's uh, working, doing the best he can. It's not easy. It's not a miracle job. But I'm sure he'll learn and he'll gain. And we must support him. We must support him more than we get critical of him because he has that task to do. So he needs everybody's help, whether it's in Maywood, Broadview, Bellwood, or Berkeley. We're all one together, whether we like it or not.